time machine will allow you to make a full backup of your Mac so that you can retrieve files in the future or completely restore to a different Mac. But since a full backup using Time Machine takes a lot of space, you might want to reduce the amount of files to backup in order to save space on your external hard drive and also save time for backing up as well as restoring. To do that, you first can look up under about in the upper left corner and click on storage to find out how much disk space you have available and also the type of files which are occupying your hard drive. To find out which files takes the most space on your Mac, click on manage and then you can see on the left pane which type of files take how much space on the hard drive. For example, under documents uses quite a lot of files as well as iTunes. So in case these are files that you don't necessarily need to back up, you can exclude these files in the time machine backup as to save space and time. Just click on the time machine icon in the taskbar and open the time machine preferences and then click on options. And then here you can add folders on your hard drive that you want to exclude from the time machine backup, thus saving a lot of space on your external backup drive as well as save time for backing up the data and restoring. In my example, I excluded iTunes media files, which are not necessarily important as I can either download them from the cloud and they are not necessary to reinstall a new Mac the way you had it before or crucial to the system. Also documents which aren't necessary to be backed up might be in a folder on your drive which you forgot that you still have and generally speaking files that you have stored which you haven't used in the last six months you probably won't need it again so the time machine backup size will probably be two times the size of the files which are occupying the disk at the moment. So if you have files which are occupying around 250 gigabytes on your hard drive, you will need at least a backup drive with 500 gigabytes or more disk space available to initiate a time machine backup.